That's Sokolov. Oh! And uh, Volgin's there, along with that woman who looks really like Eva. Which is Eva. Get your hands off me. I'm not going anywhere. Really now? How many times must I tell you? Each time you resist, your lover will suffer the consequences. Is that clear? Falcon. <laughs> Damn you! Damn, he's strong. Hey, now. That's just rude. Oh, no. Oh, the tights are ripping. Oh, dear. it right there, traitor. Oh wow, I love this scene. Any scene with Ocelot's awesome, but this one especially. Let's find out just how lucky you are. Watch closely. Russian roulette. has a single bullet in it. I'm going to pull the trigger six times in a row. Are you ready? Well, that was pretty badass, although Sokolov pissed himself. Looks like your luck hasn't run out yet. Mm. Oh ho! There's no such thing as luck on the battlefield. You'd better stay in line from now on. The Cobras will take care of him. You're gonna disarm his gun as well. I don't know what it is with her and do. Oh, oh. Jesus, the hell, boss! You have problems. You see a gun and you just think, oh, I have to take that apart. Oh, yeah. Ocelot's mad. Has the CIA dog been disposed of yet? The pain is dead. What? He may be a child, but he's definitely one of yours. I fear Khrushchev may have a hand in this. We have no time to lose. You must eliminate him before the final test. Don't worry. They'll be able to handle it. I'm leaving him to you, the fear. Oh my god! He's a scary dude. The 
Owl Man is always sleeping. Is he all right? The end is saving what life he has left in him for battle. Normally, he's dead. But he'll wake up when the time is right. Oh, it's gonna rain and again. And when he does, it will be the end for the boy. Yeah. Sokolov isn't worth your love. You can entertain me until the rain stops. Have I forgot, you know, have I mentioned how much I hate Volgin? He's such a bastard. Great villain, though. Kuwabara. Kuwabara. Is that you? Certainly looks like it. And they're just leaving the end there in his wheelchair. That's the dude you can snipe. As soon as the cutscene ends, right about now, you can get out your sniper and snipe him in the face. Um, in fact, I don't have a sniper equipped. I'm just going to zoom in on his face just to show that you can. I'm not going to actually do it though, because that would be mean. You know, that's not very fair, is it? Some SVD. There we go. Uh, is TNT not in my weapon things? So oh, there it is. Take that out. So yeah, we can get our sniper out. And yes, you can snipe him. Just about there, see? We could do it. Yeah, I, I have your life in my hands, old man. But no, no, that would be cruel. And like I say, not very fair, not very manly, a bit cowardly. So, anyway, yeah, um, like I was saying, Volgin's a great villain in my opinion. Someone asked me why the hell, um, how the hell does he have electricity running, you know, in his body? The hell's all that about? It's never really explained, but I guess it's just like having psychic powers or something like that, you know, it's, it's not realistic, but hey, it's MGS, it doesn't need to be. It's just, you know, it's good. It makes him very interesting. And our camo sucks. Why the hell is it so bad? Do we not have anything better? The black would be better, actually. What about anything else? No. Okay, well, I guess the face. Oh, the face is fine. Alrighty. Oh, tons of guards in this place. I can see three. Hmm. We need to get inside this warehouse. Oh, this could be tricky. I could use my sniper to take him out, but that would be loud, and we don't want that. Die. Die. Die! How is he not dead? And that's, uh... Wait a sec, I thought I had a suppressor. Do I not have a suppressor? I thought I did. Why, why isn't it uh, equipped here? Do I have to put it in my backpack or something? What? I could have swore I had an extra suppressor for that gun. I'm confused. Uh. Okay, I guess we're back on the Trank gun then. Wait a sec. Oh, put the suppressor on and off with the X button. There we go. That's better. I thought it did it automatically. Right, he's dead. Unknown position. Don't send reinforcements. No! No! Don't send reinforcements, I said. How's this dude not dead? Oh shit, shield dudes. You know what? I'm gonna keep on shooting him. Oh, he moved! Fucker. I'm running out of ammo here. This is trying my patience. How many bullets did that dude take? About eight or nine? Usually it's, you know, six is more than enough to kill anything that moves, but no, this dude is an exception to the rule, apparently. Shield dudes, I'm just going to wait for them to bugger off. Cowardly, yes. But hey, I wonder if I could just snipe him, actually. Sniper rifle's pretty heavy, though, so you don't really want to be carrying it around too much. 
Yep, okay, that's one down. Shield dude's gonna be difficult to hit though. You aren't though, sir, are you? Oh, fuck, maybe you are! <laughs> Goodbye. I love sniper rifles. Hmm. Can I shoot you through the... Oh, yes, you turned at the wrong moment then, sir. Oh, shot! That's all of them done! And dusted, as they say. Nice sniping those snake, and yes, there's a frog over there we could shoot if we wanted to. Do do do. Let's have a bit of an explore underwater. And yeah, killing people isn't going to give me a very good rank at the end of this. More suppressors, ammo, and uh, depending on how many kill, how, how many kill, how many people you kill, um, has an effect on a on a, another boss fight later on. But I'm not going to ruin that. That's just going to be fun. The amount of people I've killed already. And we're going to get the night vision goggles. Electronically amplifies weak dim light for visualization. Allows one to see in the dark. Consumes battery of power while used. Uh, that would have been useful in the fucking cave, wouldn't it? But no, you give it me now. When there's not really going to be any more dark areas that I can think of. I don't know, maybe one or two, but that's about it. That would have been so damn useful in the cave. But no, 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 they wouldn't give it me then, would it? Would they? Mm. Anyway, these dudes are corpses, so I shall mess around with their bodies a bit. Oh, stun grenade full. Get rid of my sniper, actually. I don't need to carry that around anymore. It just weighs too damn much. See, 4.6 kilograms. Very heavy weapon. Anything else around here that I can pick up before I move on? I don't think so. We can't go that way. That's where they went. So we will go around here. Into the warehouse. Ah, I hate this place as well. This is where I'm probably going to get spotted. No one around that corner. Do a bit of stalking. Nice slow walking up the steps. Why footprints don't make any noise. Footprints, footsteps. Footprints don't make any noise. <laughs> right, what's my camo like in here? Not very good. Could get the splitter on for urban environments, which is what we're in. So yeah, we'll stick with that. I do like that camo for some reason. Right, there are going to be guards in here. Hmm. In fact, there's two of them down there. And that's where we're going to be going up those stairs, but there's going to be a guard up there as well, I'm guessing. 